This is Motorola Edge 50 Neo and today I'll show how you can fix overheating issues on this device. Well, let me begin this video by sharing a few advices on how you can prevent overheating from occurring since well, preventing an issue is a way more effective way to deal with it than fixing it once it has already happened. So my first advice for you guys is that you do not uh, expose your smartphone to the direct sunlight for extended periods of time since well obviously light equals heat and there is no need to uh, well get or produce any more heat than the phone already does so what that means is while or when outside try keeping your phone in the shadow or preferably in your pocket bag purse or something like that some place that will be dark and will not be directly affected by the sun rays. Another uh, preventive measure you can also enroll is to avoid fast charging. Since I would assume in 90% of cases overheating can be attributed to, well, battery or the root of the overheating issue lays within battery and charging included. So, you know, taking care of charging and battery in general can also reduce those um, Mm, reduce how often often those problems occur or happen and what you can actively do is launch your devices settings then enter the battery category here go into the charge boost charge boost feature and switch it off as you can see from the feature description while this feature is enabled uh, this process may heat up your device so yeah disable it if you experience constant passkey overheating uh, problems then not leaving the batteries category of settings you can also optimize your battery uh, charging by switching on the adaptive battery feature or rather the battery usage and uh, switch on the optimized charging to optimize your battery charging well the name of this feature the name of this function is pretty self-explanatory and then if you would like to uh, help your device to cool itself down a little bit faster, you can switch on the battery saver, which will uh, reduce the performance and processing speed that is available to your device. Hence, it will uh, consume and use uh, less electricity, hence less heat. Uh, even though you will lose a pretty significant uh, chunk of your performance here, but uh, as as a non-permanent measure, like temporary measure, it is worth enrolling it. So your device will have a chance to cool itself down. Anyway, as far as this video goes, that'll be it. So thanks for watching and bye-bye.